Hi and welcome to a video tutorial on how to calculate 95% confidence intervals in Microsoft Excel 2013 for UVIX EPHE 245 course. The first step that you are going to need to take to calculate your confidence intervals is select the data in which you would like to compare. In this case, I have selected week 1 and week 2 data from the speed stacking results from one lab section. The second step is to calculate the different scores between week 2 and week 1 data for each subject from that lab section. To do that, you're going to select the cell, enter equals, select subject 1 from week 2, minus subject 1 from week 1, enter, and you're going to follow through with that for the rest of that lab section or the rest of your data. Once you have calculated the different scores for all the data between week 2 and week 1, or whichever weeks you would like to compare, you will need to calculate the mean of differences, the standard deviation of differences, the total count, which is the number of subjects, the square root of the count, the t-score, which is your scaling factor, and from there you will be able to calculate your confidence interval. In order to calculate the mean differences, select the cell or an open cell, enter equals, average, select the difference scores, enter. To calculate the standard deviation of differences, select the open cell or an open cell, enter equals, stdev.s or stdev, select the difference scores, enter. To determine the total number of subjects you are looking at, enter equals, count, in parentheses select the difference scores again, and to calculate the square root of the count, enter equals SQRT, in parentheses select the count value. Now to calculate your t-score, which is your scaling factor, you are going to enter equals TINV, in parentheses, because we're looking at 95%, we're going to put 0.05, comma, and our degrees of freedom is the number of subjects we are examining, minus 1, in this case it would be a count of 14 minus 1, which is 13, close parentheses, enter. Once you have calculated all these variables, you can now calculate your confidence interval. In order to calculate your confidence interval, select another open cell, enter equals, select your t-score, times, now in parentheses, select your standard deviation of differences, divided by your square root of your count, close parentheses, enter, and now you have calculated your confidence interval at 95%. Thank you very much.